Hey, thanks for joining me. What a horrible thing to have to discuss, eh? This guy should have done, should have, and could have done so much good. Ah, it sucks monkey butts. It is what it is. But uh, this is, uh, I'm not, I don't want to give him any ideas. This is just thoughts on ways that he possibly could get away with it and all that. Now, I'm not trying to help him get away with it. I'm just saying, hey, uh, let's be real. Uh, this gentleman will have a whole lot of film on a whole lot of people. And plus, there's actually some legitimate excuses. So, here we go. P. Diddy, just a tax charge. Here's how, just a tax charge. 50% of the parties is just a rich guy providing place for his friends of their party, using rich fen- friends, big place to hold it. And the uh, meaning being is uh, lots of people have uh, people that have large properties and they have a funeral or a wedding or a celebration, a party, uh, New Year's Eve, uh, anything like that, bonfire, uh, anything like that. They say, hey, can we use your... Uh, land or can we use your building can we use such and such because maybe they don't have anything big enough for the people that they really want to celebrate with you know connection and all that kind of stuff so and 40 percent of the parties were on his property but so huge that he didn't have control of them hilton hotel families not charged for drugs found in their patrons room you know so maybe he's acceptable for a fine on that kind of stuff. I think he could get away with that. So there's 90% of the stuff wiped off. So now we got 10% left. Here's the 10%. Dan Snyder. You know that uh, Nickelodeon guy. If he's got him on film, people want to get that gentleman. If he's got him on film, they just uh, supply him to the news. And we got two years of court and stuff like that where nobody paying attention to Diddy. They are paying attention to Dan. If I was Dan Snyder and I was ever around uh, any of these people, I think you're uh, in uh, exposure danger, if you know what I mean. I think uh, throw you to the wolves while they uh, do other stuff. Allegedly, if they're guilty, that kind of stuff. So, but it's looking bad. And uh, Mr. Clyde Davis. Wow, is it ever going to look bad for this gentleman lately? Uh, rumors from before, but now, like, P. Diddy has stuff on film and recording. So if you were ever talking about, hey, do this and do that, and this is how you do business, and uh, I know you would be paying attention to it. However, Diddy seems to be pretty darn big. So he's growing or smarter. So if you've ever said anything about Whitney or Janis Joplin and their deaths and uh, maybe, hmm, 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 you know, if he throws you to the wolves, he's clean. You know, if he's got Dan Snyder with all those children, allegedly, and Clive Davis allegedly, maybe uh, some questionable business moves, um, that's five years of, j- of court news and stuff. So in five years, then we'll discuss Mr. Diddy, which, you know how that happens. You know how that happens. So anyway, thanks for joining me. Thanks for conversing. Uh, keep coming back. Enjoy. I'm sorry, this is this subject. It sucks. But, uh, you know, at least we made this connection. 